Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix Experian credit report lock-in problem. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, the first thing you need to do here is you first need to check your internet connection. Now, sometimes if you're having problems with your lock-in on the Experian app, typically checking your internet connection can solve this. So for example, if you use Google, so just an example, I'm going to go to Google here, just type in internet speed test. So just type in internet speed test. And from here, if you see your internet speed actually pretty slow, it means the cause itself is going to be your internet speed. So changing to a different network, like for example, if you're using mo your mobile data, switch to a Wi-Fi connection and see if that solves your issue. Now, if your internet connection is not a problem, well, in this case, it might be the actual app. So what you need to do is you first need to make sure that you're using the latest version of the app itself. So in this case, look for Google Play Store here in your mobile device. And from here, you want to look or search for Experian. Now, if you see any update button, go ahead and click on it. And from then on, once it's fully updated, go ahead and open it up again and see if that solves your issue. Now, if that doesn't solve your issue, the final thing that we could do here is to clear your cache, which in this case, cache are going to be temporary files that is in your mobile device. So clearing them does not directly affect your mobile device. So you won't, lo you won't be losing any data here. So what you need to do is you need to look for the Experian app here, press and hold on it and choose the app info option. Now from here, choose the option that says clear data at the bottom right of your screen. And from here, click on clear cache at the very bottom and click on OK. Now once you've done that, go ahead and open up uh, Experian again and see if that solves the issue. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.